what's up you guys welcome back to my channel so we are going to do a video on our red iguana hand i have lisa lisa however you want to say it l-y-z-a so i'm gonna show you guys how i put the tips in and how i use my hand So as many of us want to do when we first get it, we want to put like glue and we want to glue it on and we want to glue the tip, but I realize that it kind of leaves residue and it's a little hard to take off. So what I do instead is take a size either three or four nail tip and what you do is you just slide it in here. And it's pretty short enough to where it's like somewhat of a natural nail, but I'm gonna take it a little bit further and I am going to cut it a little bit more. Like that, and then I'm gonna round out the edges like that. And like that. So it's somewhat more of like a natural shape. And then what I'm going to do is take another three or four, whatever you use here, you want to use um, as your tip. So you're just going to make sure that fits. And then we're going to glue this guy on. I can find my glue. whatever length and shape you want. Kind of deal. And then we'll apply him and then I'll show you how to use a form on your nail. So let's go ahead, apply this, and then we'll get to this guy. going to do now is say you want to do a sculpture now so we are going to go ahead and take our forms and what we're going to do is that middle piece where the nail bed comes we're gonna go ahead and do this guy so you just want to make him like double-sided want to roll it like that if you have double-sided tape that would work as well but if you don't bam 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 then we're gonna go in with a tip again and stick that guy in gonna chop him up Then you're gonna come in with your nail form. 
and you want to just like pinch it to your however just want to go ahead and pinch that to your liking and then what you can do is just kind of squeeze it under but use that tape underneath as a holder so now you can use your nail form so we'll go ahead and build a nail on this guy and we'll go ahead and do that now Okay, so now that you took that form off, we are going to wait for it to dry just a little bit more and then we are going to file and shape them. And it's a little bit easier if you just like pull them out to file them because if you kind of leave them in the hand, the hand gets all wonky and it moves on you so it's just really inconvenient. So let's go ahead, oh, let's go ahead and let's get these filed. So now we're going to go ahead and fire this guy. I hope you guys enjoyed that little kind of tutorial on how to use your red iguana hand. I hope you guys have as much fun as I do with it. And if this taught you anything at all, please like and subscribe and keep in lookout for the next video. Bye loves!